Marissa Round is a college volleyball athlete, but when she began feeling a pain near her groin and had trouble with routine activities, she knew something was wrong. I basically told him it hurts to walk for a prolonged time and it hurts to walk upstairs and it hurts to go from the gas to the break. And so pain in the front of the hip that is aggravated by activities of flexion. So even just sitting in a car for a long period of time, sitting at your desk for a long period of time where your hip is flexed and pinching it can be a problem. Some different sporting activities tend to cause pain as well. She came to the Sports Medicine and Performance Center at the University of Kansas Hospital and saw Dr. Scott Mullen, who could see the problem right away. I see it every day, and so um, I can see people walking down the street that I might guess might have this problem. The underdiagnosed problem is femoroacetabular impingement, or FAI. It can affect up to 70% of college athletes. It occurs when bony overgrowths around the hip socket keep the joint from moving as it should. Doctors may try physical therapy and pain relief medicine, but the best cure is a minimally invasive surgery. What we do is we make two or three small incisions and we go in and we shave down the bony bump on the socket side and we, so that um, at the end of the surgery we can flex the patient's hip up as far as possible and show that the bones no longer touch. Marissa decided to go for it. Well, I like driving and I like to walk upstairs, so I was all for it because I don't want to live another like 20 years if I can't walk upstairs, you know? Dr. Mullen performed the surgery and what a difference it made. It doesn't hurt to go upstairs anymore. I can sleep normally and I can get out of bed. I don't feel anything. I don't feel pain. Her prognosis is excellent and greater than 90% of people have um, good to excellent outcomes from this surgery. So this is a very effective surgery that has a track record of having very good outcomes. Thank you.